Welcome to Morning Drawfee, where we take your dumb suggestions and make even dumber drawings. I'm Caldwell. I'm Nathan. And I don't know how to pronounce suggestion, but we are going to do one anyway. Yeah. It's from Rachel Walsh. She says, Dear Wait, she's Wait, Rachel Walsh. What did she say? She said, please draw characters for your own young adult trilogy. Okay. I don't care about the genre, but I guess dystopia is the in thing, so why not that? It's gotta be dystopia. Yeah, dude. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it should just be called the Dystopia Trilogy. Dyso dystopia High School. Dystopia. <laughs> Welcome to Dystopia High School. <laughs> dystopia Point High. <laughs> yeah. um, so this is our main character. Her name is uh, Jane Planerson. Jane Planerson. And she's just a normal girl, just like you. Yeah. That's how... That's... that's uh, you can really relate to it. But mm -hmm. she's... You know what? She's a little bit special. She's a little special. She doesn't... She doesn't quite get it. She doesn't you know? quite know it yet. But there's something special about her. And it, she she oftentimes says things like, Why me? I'm just Jane Planerson. Mm -hmm. I'm I, I'm not special. I'm just a normal I'm just a normal ass kid. And then she grows to find out that she is in fact she, one of one of a, a chosen few uh -huh. members of uh the elite underground rebel unit. C. Uh well, the the snowflakes. Yes. This is explained to her later, like everyone else. They're just averages, but you, you're above average, because you're a snowflake. You're a snowflake. Snowflake is an acronym for a thing, uh, that it stands oh for a thing, and I can't remember it right now, because I don't have my notes with me, but trust me on this. I'm your best friend since childhood, but secretly, the whole time, I've been watching over you, Jane. Jane I'm Patterson. actually, I'm actually a hundred mm -hmm. years old, mm -hmm. but I look and act just like a teenager. What if I told you that there was a secret world? Secret world where you can be cool. <laughs> <laughs> you can be mm -hmm. the coolest. You can be Jane Planerson. You can be Jane, interesting person there. <laughs> that's her. That's thing. her code name. Yeah. <laughs> interesting. Mm -hmm. All right. Interesting. <laughs> Here's what you get. You get to. You get to fight. Help us fight against the evil forces of Professor President. Professor President, oh. He wants to put everyone in school and no one can have fun or do what they want. Or have opinions. <laughs> opinions are the best. Here also you'll need to learn how to use this cool weapon. I'm going to draw a snowflake patch and make it not look like a butthole. <laughs> Let me do do it like, your best. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, do it like that. Yeah. There we go. Still kind of a butthole, but you know. Uh, I, I like that. I like that I think, aspect I, of I it. I think most mm -hmm. snowflakes have butthole-like mm -hmm. qualities. <laughs> Snowflakes are just like super unique buttholes. Everyone's different. Everyone's got a butthole. And they're all different. And they're all good. Except for, you know, like if you messed it up. If you poop too hard. If you poop too hard, that's on you. That's on you, but you start out with a pretty good butthole, if you ask me. That, that's the, that's the, the talking, uh, talking cat. Uh, yeah. Oh, comic yeah. relief mm -hmm. character. Because cats can't talk in this other universe. Because the thing about Jane Planerson... It's dystopia, so cats can talk. The thing That's about the Jane... topia part. Exactly. The thing about Jane Planerson, she can travel through all the planes of existence. Whoa. Yeah, that's right. Whoa. This is... So this is, so it's like a dystopia, but also mm -hmm. like a plane, planeswalker sort of, uh, sort of deal? Yeah, well, like, I think that like... Like City of, City of Secrets, City of Cool People. Yeah, there's a, multiple. I think each book focuses on a different like plane of existence that they're trying to save from Professor In, President. Instead of, instead of uh, cities, they're high schools, though. Oh, yeah. Well, cause, she goes like, to all mm, the different planes, high school planes. Yeah, and she's got like you know, kind of like a cool school of. She she wears uh, school of cars. There she is. What what kind of school of driving? What kind of um, <laughs> <laughs> chef school? Yeah, that's the that's the sec the second book is school of school of driving. But it's like yeah, everyone has to drive this way. Nobody can drive cool. No one can drive. No one can do cool. Well, you, I think you what's donuts. happening is that um, yeah, Professor President is like capturing everyone in these dimensions and making them go to re-education camps yeah. to learn how to do things his way. Yeah, to learn how to be a productive member of society. Uh, uh. No way. I'd rather just goof off and like hang out in front of the Wendy's. And also there's some like dumb arbitrary rule that yeah. like Everything else is run real efficiently, but then yeah. there's like a dumb arbitrary rule that yeah. like makes it evil. <laughs> everything, like, like everything would work just as well this way, but also like people with red hair have to be in the military. You gotta die and die. <laughs> you gotta be in the military and then die real quick. 
If you could just die after you served us in the military, thank you. She discovers later mm. that she had red hair the mm. entire time. Oh shit! It's a big, but but she just she revealed. just has she just has mousy brown hair. Yeah. Uh, but it's like I, it's it's actually just because she didn't realize that she was a snowflake. Yeah, I'm giving her a sword, but it's like a weird sword. It's, it's got to be a weird yeah, sword. It's like you know, it's like her. It's like normal, but like not quite. Oh, it's got a little divot. Yeah. You may think that makes it not as useful, but it's actually <laughs> makes it interesting and cool. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah, you might think it makes us less less useful, but you'd be right. But it also makes us look super cool. There we go. Oh, that's a cool sword. Yeah, it's kind of cool. It's kind of dumb. It's just perfectly dumb, I would say. Do you want to draw? Um, yeah, I'm gonna draw uh, the the cool the cool kid from her school who yeah. turns out to actually be like part of an ancient race. Yeah. Uh, and and one of the one of the captains of the snowflakes sent to uh, to watch over her. Um, and then also fall in love with her. Yeah, of course. He wasn't supposed to, though. I'm an immortal elf horse. <laughs> and I wasn't supposed to love you. But I love you so dang much because you're so special. And you don't even recognize how special you are. But actually, JK, I don't, I don't love you. Um, I love the dream egg that you are going to produce. Um, because that's how my people reproduce. What happens is if we fall in love with, if we think someone's super interesting, um, I get pregnant with a dream egg that we make together, and then I fall in love with the baby inside the dream egg. It's not creepy. It's not creepy. It's, it's not super, creepy. It's super not creepy. Stop looking at me like Stop, it's creepy. Don't look at me like it's creepy. Come on. Come What's on. his name? Uh, his name is uh, is is Lance uh, Bronco. Oh, nice. So what? Do we come up with a name for this yet? It's uh, her name is Jane Plain. Plainerson. Mm -hmm. um, she goes to Dystopia Peak High or Dystopia yeah. Point High. Dystopia Point High. Um, Professor President is the bad guy. I'm just reviewing the facts yeah, here. Yeah. Um, I guess we, maybe it's like the Snowflake Saga. Yeah, I think it's the Snowflake. What saga. are the three books though? Because you have to have three books in it. Yeah, it's a trilogy after all. You got Snowflake Saga, Book One, um, maybe like Plain Jane, and then Book Two is like. Uh, it's it's school 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 of, school of driving, <laughs> plain Jane in the school of driving. No, it's like Snowflake Saga book one, plain Jane. Snowflake Saga book two, uh, drivers Ed, <laughs> and then book three, um, schools out. Yeah, I think we crushed it. Perfect. Um, so this is Lance Bronco. Yeah, is he a horse? Yeah. Okay. He has he has horse. I mean, he he turns into a horse. Oh, oh, okay. So he's a wear horse. Yeah. But, like, not a centaur. It's just, like, straight up, like, sometimes he's a horse. Sometimes he's a horse. Oh, Jane, you weren't supposed to see me like this in my horse form. Let me give him, let me give him his, like, <laughs> Oh, yes! That's how you know. Yeah. Oh, you, oh, my people, the horse elves, this is our one, our, our greatest secret. Only, only other horse elves can see me in my horse form. But, but Lance, your horse form is so beautiful. Oh, I didn't expect someone like you to understand. But then again, someone like you might understand. Anyway, let's have dream sex. That's and then it. they have dream sex. They have dream sex. That's how of that happens in the second act of book two, right after they um, complete Driver's Ed. Driver's Ed, I think, is also the name of like the henchman, uh, Professor President Henchman Driver's Ed. Driver's Edward. Driver's Edward, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is up with his coat? It's a, you know, it's a trench. Oh, okay, it's coat. a full on trench, yeah. No, it's, it's got to be deep trench. It's, it's got to be. It's got to be cool. This What's... thing's full on Marianas. I think it should be like tattered at the bottom, maybe. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, a tattered trench. That's how it would be described in the book. It's like he walked in like Lance always wore a tattered trench. It was really ragged and awful. Uh, and like the reason it's tattered that got, you learn later. He's got like real high pants. Yeah. And, like real skinny. I think real the, skinny leg. And then the reason jeans. Yeah. Yeah. And like she's like, oh, I always thought it quite peculiar. peculiar. That his trench was so tattered, but it turns out it's because he was turning into a dang horse all the time, because of all of his horse, horse trans horse formations. Trans horse first. Trans horse, horse first. Trans hoofers. Trans hoofers. I don't know what's going on with this arm. <laughs> don't worry about it. I don't it. know how that works. I think we gotta. I think we gotta cinch okay, this thing up. Okay, okay. Can I? Can I hop back in and draw Professor President? Yeah. Let me just. Uh... And then I'll draw. Um, uh, snow or I'll draw like plain Jane as the title, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Cool. And I'll give it like a cool symbol. All right. Let me hop back in. Okay. 
<laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm getting antsy. I'm getting antsy because I love this idea so much. It's a good idea. All right, we so, should sell it and make yeah. millions of dollars. I'm just gonna draw him like kind of like, uh, yeah. like shadowed up here. Oh, Professor President, he's yeah. so evil. He's so evil. He's oh. so evil, but also kind of charismatic. Why do you hate fun and like? Why do you remind me of like a fuckable dad? <laughs> He's such a fuckable dad. Damn, that, damn you, Professor President. That, that's You're a, like my dad, except I'd have sex with you. That's that's the the secret. Is mm. Professor President is uh. actually uh, oh is yeah, actually her dad. He's actually her dad. Ah, uh, because her dad died when she was very young, or did he? Or did he? Uh huh. Right. And that's and like oh, but she's still. So like everyone's like, a little weird. You can't out. tell me what to do. I like, You're not my dad. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, am, am I? I? <laughs> I'm everyone's dad. I'm Professor President, Dad. But also secretly very much your dad. But also I'm But 100% very much your daddy. Um, I like the idea that she reveals that she, he's got like a cool beard too. Um, it kind of goes out like that. Maybe I should draw him. Let's shrink this a little bit so I can get a little more face time with uh, Professor Perez. Professor President. I like to think PP that. As, yeah, PP. You know. As the resistance the, calls him. The double P. His PP pants as they call him. Um, in, in jest, of course. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I right. like to think that um, when Lance tells everyone that he wants to, you know, marry the dream egg that he makes with uh, Jane, yeah, nobody bats an eye. But when when Jane tells everyone that she wants to like that she could, totally wants to hook up with Professor President, mm-hmm. uh, everyone's like, ah, oh, what? Oh no, oh, that's, no your that's your dad. Dad, gross, you. But like, why was the dream egg thing okay? Well, that's just natural. That's like that's how it works. That's how life works. You here. know, it, horses and their dream eggs. You don't know nothing about horse elves, and you're being really inconsiderate right now. He's got like a real cool quaff of hair. Again, just like wait, like kind of like looks too good. Looks too good to be a dad, but he is. That's the, that's the reveal. It's because you know why is why? because he takes all of the individuality and uh-huh. originality. Oh, from and he like uses it for and himself. He uses it for for youth. Oh, that's true. It, it sustains him. Mm-hmm. Uh, like oh yeah, like kids not getting to like hang out and be idiots. Yeah, like, he he uses that energy. Such, it's. I mean, there's a lot of energy that is being contained. And that's like the the weird message is like picture it. All the energy that. You generate from just being you. <laughs> He's using that. He's stealing our individuality. Oh man, this is like. I feel like we're just like borderline making something feasible. I don't know. It seems almost right. All right, I'm gonna draw. Uh, what I guess it'd be like up here, maybe. Kind of like plain. Nope. Try again. Try again, buddy. Here you go. I'm gonna shrink it a little bit. Pla- Plain ahead. Mm-hmm. <laughs> plain Jane. So it's plain. It's plain, like because she travels through many exactly through many planes. That's like the, of the joke. That's yeah. the that's the pun title. Mm-hmm. And when they make the movie, like all three of them will be called Plain Jane and um, the Snowflake Saga. No, it won't. Even, the, yeah, like that's the thing. It'll be Snowflake Saga Book mm-hmm. One, Plain uh, Jane, uh, and <laughs> Driver's Ed. <laughs> that's such a worse title. Why would you do that? Mm-hmm. Uh, so because it's, the, you know, it's for young adults. Exactly. They don't understand. They don't understand how books work because of Kindles. Most of our fans. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, as always. So there's the book. Um, you know what there needs to be? What? There, yes. There needs to be just like, just some like nondescript like. Oh, like an like, award? Like robot stuff. Oh, I like that. I thought just, you were going to say it like, had won like a Sprumner's award for oh, young adult cool literature. Yeah. No, it's just like a, like an, an angry, this, yeah, just like an angry robot. Oh, absolutely. That, like, you know, they're, they're I like the, that this doubles as like a, as a, um, like 90s Super Nintendo video game cover. It, it, it like works on both levels, which is kind of fun. It's just like a fun commentary on how uh, culture has cycled. Uh, okay. Oh, you just drawn him back in there. Yeah. Just, Who's the author of this, by the way? Oh, uh, I think Corm Engelbert. Oh, absolutely. No, I think it would, it would be Corm Engelbert's daughter. Uh, oh, uh, uh, Le- Jandis. Jandis. Jandis Engelbert. Jandis Engelbert. Uh, yeah. we're out of room, but yeah. imagine yeah. that being drawn on the bottom there, where the feet cut off. Well, guys, I think that's probably gonna uh, gonna do it for us. Um, this is hitting the shelves. Uh, Q four. That's you know for those of you guys that aren't like you know business people like us that's going to be uh soon per, 
Yeah. That's going to be very soon. Later. Mm -hmm. Just look for it on shelves. Um, look for the video game tie in. Look for the app. Uh, actually, download the Snowflake app, and that's going to like, that's actually a, um, that's a sex finding service. But download Snowflake, the movie app, and that will be the app you're looking for. And that's going to give you all the updates on Plain Jane and the Plain Jane Overse. Uh, guys, thanks so much for watching. Nathan and I are going to go make a dream egg together. We're very sorry.